hello guys welcome to starlight kids club so today's session is going to be a little bit different from what we're used to today we're going to be doing read along we're going to be having a read along session okay so i'm going to be reading a book to you guys we'll read it together we'll, we'll read the book together and then i want you to follow me as i read the book so you're basically going to read along with me as well the title of the book and the contents of the book will be made available to you shortly so what i need to do is to listen to read with me pronounce the words as i pronounce them and then at the end of the reading i'll be asking you a few questions and i expect you to answer them correctly as well so i'm sure you are ready so we're going to dive into the book right about now okay so the title of the book we're going to be reading today is called mama antelope's house so we're going to dive into it right about now long ago all animals lived in the village mama antelope had a big house one day Hare wanted to play a trick. He thought and thought and thought. He crept into Mama Antelope's house. He closed the door and made a lot of noise. Mama Antelope came home. Mama Antelope came home and said, Who is in my house? She cried. Ayana, please help. Someone is in my house. Knock, knock knock open the door howled ayana but the door didn't open ayana called the giraffe open the door shouted giraffe but the door didn't open giraffe called zebra open the door yelled zebra but the door didn't open zebra called elephant he was big and strong Open the door, commanded Elephant, but the door didn't open. Mama Antelope was sad. All the animals were sad. Who was in Mama Antelope's house? The birds sang, the butterflies flapped, the bees buzzed. Open the door, they all cried. Baby Antelope came home. Who is in our house? Please open the door. She asked sweetly. The door opened. It was Hair. Hair was smiling. He loved tricks. Hooray, hooray. Mama Antelope and baby Antelope are happy. The animals are happy. Mama Antelope's house is open at last. Now that is the end of our story today. I hope you enjoyed reading it, listening to me as I enjoyed reading it to you guys. And I hope you were able to pick one or two words, the correct pronunciations of the words. And I hope you're also ready to start pronouncing the words properly. Now you can listen to the video over and over again so that you can really get the right frame of things. However, I've got two questions to ask you based on this story. Now, the first one is, how many animals were mentioned in this story? So you tell me the number and you list the animals for me. That's one. And number two, you will tell me who was hiding in Mama Antelope's house. So those two answers should be sent to me via WhatsApp voice notes. I need to hear your voices. I want to know what your answers are through your voices so tell an adult or if you could do it yourself i need you to send a voice note of the answers to this question so i'll be waiting for you and i'm sure you'll do that quickly okay so in the meantime take good care of yourselves and god bless you